now the eight champions, 14 qualifiers the Masters. Just talk about that. I'm going to be honest with you, Steve. I'm speechless. Um, I know I keep saying the same thing over and over again, and all credit goes to the kids, but you've seen the effort, and, and the, the, they wrestle with so much passion. This is not an easy place to win, to make it out. This is not an easy place to win. And our kids persevere. They push past all the challenges, and they persevere. So I'm extremely happy, exhausted, all in, all in one, buttoned up. I know this has been a tough season for you. Just yes, talk about what it means, you know, being all, almost a month and a half off, and yeah. you come back and, and win the CIF title. Definitely. Well, you know, I hurt my knee towards the end of December, and I haven't been wrestling at all. So we've had four practices coming into this tournament. And as you can tell, I'm pretty tired. But we're going to pick that up within the next few weeks. We're getting ready to state and Masters. But my team pushed me. Coach Bellamy pushed me. Coach Robert pushed me. The whole coaching staff, the school is awesome. You know, everyone's, everyone's just a part of this win. But does it add to it, the fact that, that you had to work so hard just because of the injury and to win it? Yeah, definitely. It definitely feels a lot better knowing that I could uh, beat the kid who beat me last year at Masters. It's definitely a great feeling. And I, you know, I just gotta push through every match. It's always a grind. These matches are tough. I'm, I'm winded, but we're gonna be good for the next few weeks. And talk about what the team did this week. I mean, you got eight guys in the finals. You have a good shot to, to go eight for eight in that and maybe yeah, uh, four for 14 the next week. Yeah. Yeah, we, we sent 14 guys to Masters already, so that's huge. We locked up the team points before the finals even started, so that's huge. The team's just unbelievable this year. We're a great group of guys that have come together and just work so hard for each other and for the program. I mean, Zach Cunningham had a match, and he looked over at us and said, I got you guys, and ended up winning that match. So we're just a team and we're a family, and we're, we do it for each other. First of all, just talk about being able to cap this great effort of, of eight champions and, and 14 qualifiers to Masters. It's amazing and, you know, like I said last year, it's, it's a team effort. Um, I'm so proud to be on this team. We have 14 guys going to Masters and it's amazing. You know, we train all year, all year hard. And we got progressively better and better every single year. Even at the beginning of the year, we, we didn't start out with the best team. We didn't start out with six in the state. And we progressed and progressed. We had these guys at, at the spots we needed to be. And it's amazing. You know, six in the state right now. And I, I still think we're underrated. I still think we're, we, we're not as, you know, ranked as high as we should be. But, you know, you'll see what happens at Masters next, next okay. week. And we're, I think we'll still have those eight champions to be eight champions next week and many more. So that's, it's an amazing feeling. Man. And um, talk about your match. Pretty tough one, it looked like, but, but you were able to prevail. Um, it was, it was pretty tough, but uh, the guy, he weighed in at 198, and he was just really fast, very quick, and I didn't want to make any mistakes, so I, I didn't uh, I didn't take as many shots as I should have been, and I still, you know, still came up with the W, and, uh, you know, I only think that was my toughest match of the whole weekend. My first match was 7-6 to six against Waka Yada, and he was, he was the toughest match I had. But this one it took a lot of energy, and you know, I just got to, you know, be a two-time CIF champ, and you know, I'm just happy. Okay.